it is an ultra uh, rare disease. Um, and a majority of the doctors um, that do diagnose this disease are nephrologists. Um, but by the time they come to the nephrology community, there's a reason they're coming to the nephrology community, right? Is that they've had recurrent stones and um, they may or may not have some degree of renal insufficiency. Uh, so the question then becomes is, is there an earlier way of potentially diagnosing these patients um, even before they get to the nephrologist? Um, and here you're talking about mostly the urology community. Uh, and you know, as part of the differential diagnosis, um, the way we think about it is that any child um, that has any uh, stone event, it's a single stone event, uh, that child should be evaluated for a PH1. Um, and any adult that comes in for recurrent stones uh, and has a family history of stones, uh, that individual uh, should also be evaluated for PH1 and PH1 should be part of the differential diagnosis. Thank you.